Hey guys, it's Ross Scott on the Space Coach. We're going to have our first look at this. The Art of Star Trek. I got this at a car boot sale last year for a fiver when Scott was down visiting. And the next one, next couple of books I'm going to show you are also Star Trek related. So I just slip it out of its dust jacket so we can look at it properly. Oh, now there's a classic image. Always loved that uh, painting. There is Mr. Spark with his visor. There should be some designs here for the Federation badge, I guess. Bridge designs, I think. Another bridge design. So it shows here the episodes it's referring to as starting with the cage. And where no man has gone before. <laughs> There's a classic design. I'm not sure if that's ever actually appeared on screen or not, but uh, in some of my Star Trek books, I have seen it before. Getting closer to the design of the Enterprise here as well. Oh, and that I think has appeared for three things, I'm not certain now. Beautiful artwork in this. Ah, now that looks like the Botany Bay. The design for it, anyway. Klingon ship. There's the Enterprise. There is, I don't know if it's the Galileo or not, but the Enterprise shuttle. Here's some classic images. This one, all of them, in fact. There is that one. Beautiful. Alien life. There's the, the Gorn. There is John Conacos as a um, Klingon. And see others. I remember that one at the bottom as well. Some props. In the animated show. Search for a new enterprise. A lot of these is very similar to uh, Discovery. An intermediate enterprise takes shape. Next generation. Reinventing the bridge. A new direction. So obviously that's uh, Romulan bird prey. I love that design. Not sure how practical all of this part of it was. I think this is just the main part of the ship, but. Those wings are so elegant. Some science research station. We have various aliens. Visits to the dark side. Isn't that where Tasha Yar gets killed? Or that version of Tasha Yard gets killed. Now, Deep Space Nine, the wormhole. A sampling of ships. I don't know the Star Trek ships as well as I know Star Wars. Oh, some weapons, or guns, blasters, I should say. Phasers, sorry. From the shelves of Quark's place. Hmm. And there's all the pads, the data pads. Oh, there's a uh, Neelix, is it? Oh, 
pilot concepts. The big picture, Star Trek on film. And Star Trek motion picture. Cargo bay sketch tests. Galleries of some of the designers work there. Art of storyboarding. Some more storyboarding. Star Trek II, The Wrath of Khan. The Reliant. Search for Spot. Warbird or Bird of Prey. Ah, it's right, so Romulan Warbird with the Klingon Bird of Prey. Genesis Planet Concepts. <laughs> a whale of a story. <laughs> the Voyage Home. in modern day San Francisco, well, modern day 1980s San Francisco. Okay, aliens, there's Sarek, of course. Don't remember this one at all. Final Frontier. What does God need with a starship? <laughs> Beautiful artwork in this. The same but different. <laughs> That'll be the bridge of the king on ship. <laughs> there, bah. all the king ons. <laughs> the undiscovered country. Thing on secrets. That'll be the trial, I guess. <laughs> Generations. More badge designs. Klingon ones at the bottom, I believe. A new enterprise. I thought it was a rather ugly design, to be honest, with that fat body. A tale of two enterprises. Five hundred years of costumes. And I have the book on the uh, Star Trek costumes I'll be showing you later. From the page to reality sometimes. <laughs> High tech and low tech storyboards. Details, details. The background details are always so important in science fiction shows. Preparing for the end, of course, when the saucer section separates, then crashes on the planet. Okay, 
where is that happening? So I assume this is where this book goes up to is generations. Yeah, and there is Spot, Data's cat. <laughs> is that it? Is there anything else? Oh yes. And there she is in all her glory. But yes, oh, well, another very famous image there as well. The fake alien. <laughs> so there you go, guys. The art of Star Trek. Absolutely fantastic. Bargain for a fiver. I hope you guys enjoy. I love Star Trek and I love all their art books and stuff. And, you know, I've got loads of them here as well. I think um, that and Aliens are the franchises after Star Wars I have the most of. So, yes, the art of Star Wars. Star of Star Wars. The art of Star Trek. I hope you enjoy. Please subscribe to my channel if you enjoyed this content. Leave me a comment suggestion for a topic you'd like to see discussed. Or like the video.